Middle school students brawling and the videos of some of them posted on social media. Parents are outraged and say it all starts with bullying. Christina Gonzalez went to that school in Menifee to find out what's going on. So my son's in seventh grade. Since the beginning of the year, he's been assaulted by three different individuals. My daughter, she is 12 years old. She's in seventh grade. She's now been assaulted four times within the last month. One after another, parents telling us their children, students at Ethan Chase Middle School in Menifee are being bullied and ending up in fights that are being posted on social media. Yeah. This one earlier this week where one student ended up seriously injured, according to his parents. He was hit in his face several times. He was dragged to, you know, he was dragged to the ground, hit in his face several times. There was a, I think there was a fracture right, you know, underneath his eye, the eye bone. Eye bone. A 13-year-old student was arrested on that incident. Romaland school district officials saying in a statement they are adding security on campus and that, quote, it is important to stress to our students that violence will not be tolerated. But parents are telling us the bullying and fighting have been an ongoing problem. And this student says it started with bullying by another girl over a boy. And it started off with her kind of flipping me off every now and then, saying she was going to kill me, she was going to fight me. And it got crazy to the point where she had a voodoo doll me and stabbed it. Yeah, she went to the administration when the death threats were first issued and this child was stabbing voodoo dolls of my daughter and going around and telling other students that my daughter was going to be dead, that she killed my daughter. She would not show up to school the next day. She immediately went to counselors, teachers, and administrators. And a counselor told her, don't create drama just walk away. Mom shows us a video posted on social media of the fight her daughter ended up getting into with that girl. Videos being shot and posted. Did, did you that. shoot the video? This is important. Yeah, yeah, I shot it. I just, I shot like all of these clips. What, what is this with videotaping all the fights and because putting them on Instagram? To, because we have to put it online right. so that way so the school to see it. And so we can get views. As much as it's hard to watch, it saved us because it protected our daughter from people saying she started the fight. And my kid is even saying, I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. I They're especially upset because their daughter ended up getting the same punishment as the other student. Now, a lot of parents saying things would improve if the school dealt with the bullying that usually starts at the school site before it turns into fights that usually end up happening at a park across the street. They'd also like to see more security there. In Menifee, I'm Christina Gonzalez, Fox 11 News.